Well, Anderson, there's a lot of jubilation here in this room. You can hear the celebrating going on behind me. CNN has not yet called this race, but the campaign here is certainly very optimistic uh, that this is the way the race is going, that Judge Roy Moore has indeed won. The Senate Leadership Fund, which is the, the uh, super PAC that is affiliated with Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell, has conceded that Roy Moore has won. That is a super PAC that has poured millions of dollars into this campaign. This is a massive blow uh, to the Senate Republican leadership and to the establishment. Now, this is so much more than the Republican primary in a Senate race. This is the latest battle for the soul of the Republican Party, one that has staunchly divided Republicans into two camps. And on the one hand, you have President Trump, who has gone against his natural instincts and uh, has been supporting the establishment candidate in Luther Strange, someone uh, who uh, who was a uh, Washington lobbyist for years, someone uh, who is seen very much as part of the establishment. As I mentioned, he got those millions of dollars uh, from that super PAC. On the other hand, you have people like uh, former Alaska Governor Sarah Palin and Trump's former senior advisor and campaign chairman Steve Bannon, who have come out for Judge Roy Moore. Uh, he is someone who is very much the outsider in this race, uh, has no Washington experience, someone who talks consistently about draining the swamp. He is much more in the mold of Trump. 